I felt that my character, my religion, uh, my home, and everything about what it is to be Jewish in today's world was attacked. Lies and distortions and, and politicized scholarship coming from professors who they normally would believe would know the truth and would, would be teaching the truth. You can also tell that by a lot of the, the readings, the literature that they bring into the course, a lot of the lectures they bring into the course, everything seems to be focused on a Palestinian narrative, on, on a Muslim perspective, on an Arab perspective. There is a strong pro-Israel lobby in the United States, and I think it's silly and against American national interests. So we can say this, and Hamas is a terrorist organization, sure. They also do great health care in kindergartens. He is vehemently anti-Israel, um, and he, he claims to be unbiased, but um, students that take his classes and, and tell me all the time about the incredible bias that, that he has. Hamas itself uh, is a far more pragmatic movement, not a group that is the same by any stretch of the imagination as the Taliban. The only racist state is the Jewish state of Israel. I think uh, what Israel is doing is far worse than apartheid. And I would say it's a genocide. But the Nazi Holocaust has now become the main ideological weapon for launching wars of aggression to humiliate, degrade, and torture the Palestinians. That's the problem. Uh, I was uh, outraged, and I felt a certain responsibility because of my father's endowment to the, to the university for Holocaust studies that someone had to speak up. Much like the child of abusive parents, Israelis are capable of committing their own abuses in the name of security and in defense of their own sense of victimhood. We're now seeing a situation where it's being, where the whole purpose of it is being transformed and, in my view, perverted into an attack on Israel and, a, and a, a, an attack on the Jewish community. We should really laugh away accusation of anti-Semitism.